I want to show everyone the reality of what being on set is like. It's okay. like eating a granola yeah. while also getting uh -huh. powder put on your face. Thank you, thank you. Thank, thank you so, so much. Welcome. Thank you. Good morning, guys. Happy merch launch day. First of all, a holiday merch drop is today. It's happening. The moose plushies restock the create more phone cases the scissor necklace this is our heart necklace oh my gosh i'm so excited we've been working on this drop forever and it's finally live shop.lordiy.com so it is currently 5 30 in the morning and i figured since i can't really vlog exactly what i'm doing on craftopia the show that i'm working on right now i would just take you guys through like what a regular day is like while filming i feel like i haven't done like a day in the life vlog in forever and so it's kind of the only thing that i can really vlog right now if you missed the last vlog, the execs at HBO Max actually let me show a little sneak peek of the Craftopia set if you missed that one. So I'll have that link the down bar below, but it's 5 30. We're gonna head to set and get into hair and makeup. I can probably show you guys what I'm wearing today or like a little bit of what I'm wearing today, but the outfits today are sick. We're filming two half episodes, an episode in the morning, an episode in the afternoon. This is like our third and fourth episode, I think, and like maybe our sixth day of filming. It's been so fun. Also, so sorry for like whispering. It is uh, 5 30. So yeah, oh no the lighting here is real bad. <laughs> it's real bad. I look so bad Okay, but it's 6am now just got to my green room Also, if you guys remember from last vlog it was looking rough and uh, I added some pillows Went to home goods got a blanket got this really cute like $30 Amazon rug And we've got all the fun outfits on the racks already So there's definitely a ton more color in here and it's like a happier place Thank God because I come in here and do my lunch nap on lunch break. It's not like a lunch nap It's more like a lunch close your eyes for 15 minutes if there's time but it definitely does get me through the day because I come when it's dark and I'll leave when it's dark but I'm like kind of in love with this hustle like my body has finally adjusted to waking up so early and just like working all day and then going home making dinner and going to bed but we really have come a long way they brought some pillows in and I got some pillows we got a little tiny baby rug and this little table there's my home goods blanket and I mean like I don't spend that that much time in here so it doesn't need to be anything crazy but this is really comfy for lunch break and we've got super fun outfits okay super quick sneak peek and then this is just like all my legal snack and wardrobe stuff just like sprawled everywhere but yeah guys oh my gosh these were the shoes that I wore yesterday and I posted about them on social media but how freaking fun are these oh my gosh and they're like really comfy because they're a platform the shoe options are so hot fire these were the first day shoes I'm wearing these again today I've never seen these vans before and these are so fun fingers crossed i get to keep them since they're like in a child size and like i don't know what they're gonna do with them afterwards <laughs> also oh my gosh how fun are these this is like my favorite shape are these steve madden i wonder i feel like this is the exact same ones that i have but like just in white but with a fun pattern these are so cool anyways i can't wait to wear these ones too <laughs> All right, hair is Look done, and we gonna fix this face real quick. <laughs> this is the other problem with being on set for so many hours, is the food is so bomb. Oh, what are these called in America? This is a Timbit in my brain, but I forget, uh, don't, donut hole, donut hole. But like, how could you say no to this little sprinkled donut hole? It's so cute. All right, guys, so we are dressed, we got gems, we got hair, we got makeup, I just need a lip, and we're ready to go. Also, I can't show you the full outfit, but look how fun this jacket is. These sleeves are so good. Oh my gosh, okay, so this little guy goes into your ear, like literally poking into your brain, and it's how the showrunner talks to you and gives you like prompts or commands or cues, and honestly, it took forever to get used to, but I don't mind it now. Also, Craftopia nails. Yay! All right, guys, so it is 8.30 now, so about two and a half hours later, no, like two hours later from like arrival time, hair and makeup is done, wardrobe is done, we are on set, about to start shooting, and basically how this works is we shoot like half an episode in the morning, break for lunch, and shoot the other half of a different episode in the afternoon, but it's gonna be so good. Also, they haven't announced who the judges and the guest judges are yet, so I can't show you who it is, but it's so, oh my gosh, there's like so many fun things that obviously I have to keep some of it a surprise. Even the fact that they're letting me do this is so cool. So so yeah, let's get started. I want to show everyone the reality of what being on set is like. It's okay. like eating a granola yeah. while also getting uh -huh. powder put on your face and also getting your hair zhuzhed up a little bit every time we break. <laughs> <laughs> 
This is the real life. Thank you, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. So it's like 11.30 now and we're about to announce the winner of this episode. We're so exciting. Oh my gosh, like the winning situation is so fun. Like the things that you win and the camera effects that happen and just like, oh really excited. We gotta get it. Oh, sorry, wait, wait. That's okay. Okay. But yeah, the winning announcement is so much fun. It's so exciting. It's gonna look amazing on camera. I can't wait for you guys to see it. We announce the winner and then we break for lunch and then we do it all over again. It's so weird like being in here because there's no windows since you have no concept of like what time it is, where you are in the world and any of that stuff. So we're just kind of doing a thing and uh, you get here when it's dark and then you leave when it's dark. Also, how cute are these gems? I feel like this is better lighting to like show off my makeup right now. We've been having so much fun doing fun things with makeup that I would like normally never do, but the show has such a fun concept. The set is so fun that like you would also have so much fun with your face as well which i love here for it okay i'm gonna finish this granola bar before we start rolling again and then uh we'll break for lunch oh my gosh okay we're broken for lunch it's so crazy to come out just at different times of the day and i'm like ah the sunlight give me all the vitamin d also like just like cannot open my eyes now my eyelashes start together i'm a mess I'm a mess dude do you see my struggle all the food here is so good this is so bad this is so bad caesar salad tastes so good but like let's be real it's not even good for you and like low-key hiding this little mini piece of cheesecake over here <sighs> thank gosh i'm on my feet all day or seriously i would not fit into any of my styled clothes anymore. <laughs> so back in my regular clothes, and we usually have about 20 minutes or so to eat, and then I go back into hair and makeup. We change a little bit, like it's a second hairdo for the second half of the day. Pretty much the same makeup, just like a different lip color, and then into outfit number two for the afternoon, and we're gonna do the whole thing again. Oh, this is really not the lighting. <laughs> it just like makes dark circle in the your eyes. Also, I'm breaking out so bad right here, and the poor makeup artists are having to like fight off this breakout. They really have their job cut out for them, but they are killing it. So I just got an update. Re the Create More Phone Case. Oh my gosh, let me just cover up that pimple. Yeah, there we go. So this is what it looks like. It says Create More on it, and it's a really fun pink silicone, and I really, really wanted the pink to wrap around all the way to the front. So that's what it looks like, because it kind of just like bothers me when a phone case only has a design on the back. I don't know, it's just like a weird like pet peeve so it's pink on the front too because i wanted that and it was like randomly important to me i have like news and i know it's gonna upset a few people and i just don't want y'all to come for me because it's not my fault and i just want you to know that i'm trying so hard for you guys so the case is launching tomorrow along with all the other holiday merch stuff but for right now the machine that produces these cases only makes cases for the iphone models and so the availability for all the iphone cases is like super crazy versatile like it can do all the way from the oldest ones to the newest ones the 11 uh, what's the new one? 11 Max? 11 S Max? I don't know, I can't keep up. There are so many freaking iPhone names and I just like can't even keep up with it. Anyways, all the iPhone models will be available and essentially the issue with Android and Google Phone is that it's a different machine with different bases and color options. So we haven't perfected an Android and Google case that makes it exactly like this. And I don't wanna release something that's not the same for both models or one's better, one's worse. It just like makes me feel icky. I don't like that. And so I'm really, really, really trying. We're working so hard to be able to get the other models available for now. And that's the trouble with doing phone cases and some people shy away from it, some people are really excited about it, is that there are just so many different phone models that you just can't make everyone happy. So my deepest apologies to my non-iPhone users. I know how frustrating it is and I promise I'm working on it so, 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 so hard. So stay tuned, it'll definitely be a priority for 2020. But yeah, guess what? The Moose Plushie is back and that is a one size fits all. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna head back into hair and makeup. We're gonna do our look number two for the day. And also, I went to the Logan and KSI fight after my last day on set before getting a day off. On the way to the Staples Center, I was like seat reclined, just like trying to soak in 20 minutes of eyes shut, just like trying to try to revive myself with more energy. Anyways, here's some footage from that. We are currently at the KSI and Logan. Oh God, I'm so greasy. Please divert your eyes from my face. At the KSI and Logan boxing match. <laughs> I've been up for so many hours. I feel a little crazy, but I'm excited. So we're literally three rows away. It's like so close. You could definitely get here with like some sweat or some blood. I'm a little nervous. Also, there are so many people here. It's like actually crazy. We're at the Staples Center, like the main LA venue. There's so many people here. Oh, what's up, Canada flag? Oh my gosh, guys, this guy has these awesome glitter shorts. They're so good. If I was a boxer, my shorts would look like that. Oh my god, it's fight time. It's happening.
transition from the United Kingdom. Alright guys, we're back on set for the afternoon. I totally forgot that I have a meeting tonight after today's shoot. <laughs> I've been trying to like literally come home, make dinner, and go directly to bed. Maybe watch like one episode of New Girl and just go directly to bed. So that ain't gonna be the case tonight. So I got more gems on the face and my sprout. HBO let me have my sprout. <laughs> so sprout is here. Oh, oh. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> so I want to start the afternoon. Also guys, this jacket is like so sick. It's like the definition of a crop jacket. It is very schmuck. All right. All right guys, it is 6 p.m. now and we are officially wrapped for the day. Man, I feel like standing is almost more tiring for an entire day than walking around. I feel like this sounds like kind of like an old person to me, but like I feel like I need to get some like insoles made or something for how much freaking standing we are doing. I wish I had my Apple watch so I could track how much I'm standing. But today was so much fun and so many of you guys that are competing on the show watch my videos and I love getting to meet you You're a DIY babe a pretty little lord like literally two of the contestants today dropped off gifts for me My freaking heart. I die. I die. You guys are so sweet. Bubba come here <gasps> Yes, who is this Bubba bear? All right guys, so I am home. Also, there's nothing better than coming home to your puppo after a long day at work. I seem to be more excited about returning home than Moose is, but that's okay. I hope today was interesting for you guys. I just got home, it is almost seven right now, and I have a dinner meeting tonight <sighs> at eight. It's not too far from my house, which is good, but hopefully I'll be home by 10 and asleep by 10.01. And then my ride tomorrow morning is coming at 6 a.m. and we gonna do it again. Oh my gosh, this has been such a crazy lifestyle. I'm finally adjusting like my body clock is less tired by the end of the day I feel like the first couple days of being on set for 12 hours I was just like straight up dead when I got home. I couldn't carry on a conversation I couldn't do anything and now I'm finally able to like continue being a human when I get home Which has been really nice. I can already tell that I'm going to miss filming this show so Freaking much by the time we're done today was officially the one-third mark of filming all the episodes and it has flown by like I feel like we just start up oh. hello what's doing ah! but yeah we officially hit the one third mark of being done filming all of our episodes and i feel like it has just flown by i feel like we just started yesterday i feel like we we're just in rehearsals and it's gonna go by so quickly and i already miss all the crew and the hair and the makeup team everyone's been so sweet and it's like you just become a family so quick because you spend so much time together but it's been so freaking fun i've never really done anything like this especially at this scale and i have learned so freaking much i truly am so excited for you guys to see this show it's gonna be incredible these kids these crafters are so insanely talented like like they are light years ahead in crafting skills than I was at their age and I am so so that is it for today's vlog. Don't forget that the holiday merch drop is happening today, 3 p.m. PST, 6 p.m. EST. While you're watching this, it is probably live, so go grab yourself a moose plushie, a heart scissors necklace, one of the new hoodies, or flannels, because I think this is the last merch drop of 2019. Dude, that's so crazy. 2020 is around the corner. That is crazy. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed this vlog. If you haven't seen last Sunday's video, that'll be linked in the down bar below. And I will see you guys on Sunday for a Sunday wedding and on Wednesday for another weekly vlog. Okay, bye guys. Love you. I'm the DIY queen, that's the royal elite. My pretty little kingdom out here running the streets.